He that has an ear, let him hear what the word is saying. In Job 2.32, the scripture is saying, There shall be deliverance in Mount Zion and in Jerusalem for the remnant. For all those who call on the name YHWH. YHWH. That is the Father's name. That name is mentioned over 7,000 times in the Old Testament. Well, on the day of Pentecost, Peter preached from Joel 2, 28 to 32. He told the remnant that asked the question, what must they do to be delivered? He told them that they must repent and be baptized in the name YHWH. How do I know that? Because I hear what the scripture is saying. The scripture that existed then was the Old Testament. There was no New Testament. The name that Peter used was the name that Joel the prophet prophesied that they would have to use. That is the same name and the only name in the sanctuary for come back and see. You see, without that name in the statement holiness to Yahweh, holiness to YHWH, the high priest could not enter in to the holy of holy place to take in the blood. Exodus 28, 36 through 38. And that is the name that the high priest mentioned once a year for the cleansing of the veil in the sanctuary. It was the only name given. The name was given by the Almighty to Moses. The only name given was not given to Mary. It was not given to Joseph. The only name given was Y.H. W.H. in the scriptures. Peter said that name on the day of Pentecost. 3,000 Israelites was baptized calling on that name. Paul in 2215 was told that he would be a witness to all men what he have seen and heard. And I quote from Acts 22, 16. And now why are you waiting? Arise and be baptized and wash away your sins calling on the name YHWH. This was told to Paul. And Paul quotes from the scripture in Romans 9, 17, when he says, and that name was to be made known throughout the whole earth. He quotes from the scripture, Exodus 9, 16. Brothers and sisters, the scriptures say that there's only one name given, and that name was given to Moses. And Joel said that name was the name they had to call on to be delivered. That's what the scriptures said that Peter was preaching from on the day of Pentecost. Then you might ask, how come the New Testament say that Peter said, the name Jesus, which did not exist at that time, 
in the Wikipedia was pretty Greek. The name would have been Jesus. Jesus was a Greek name. Peter spoke Hebrew. And all the people spoke Hebrew, according to Acts. Acts 21 40. How come we are told today that Peter was quoting Joel 2.32 but when he got to the name that they should be calling on it turns out to be an entirely a different name than the name that Joel said they should call on to be delivered. If you have an ear, hear what the scripture is saying. The scriptures is saying the name that they were supposed to call on and the name that they did call on was YHWH. That is the covenant name. So how can we now expect to be delivered calling on another name that is not the name of the almighty creator who said that we must call on his name quote from Joel 2 32 for in Mount Zion and in Jerusalem there shall be delivered as Yahoo, as YHW has said, he said, he said, deliverance in his name, as he has said, the Almighty said, deliverance in his name to be delivered. And he has only one name, but he has many titles. He was manifested as Yahushua, the Savior. But he is the Almighty Creator, Yahoo. And his Holy Spirit, which is his spirit, has the his same name. Yahoo the Ruka the Spirit, the Holy Spirit. His Spirit is holy because it's His Spirit. I've never heard of a ghost being holy. A ghost was always one who was damned to wonder throughout eternity with nobody. There's only one name given. That name is Y.H. Think about who would want to deceive us as he deceived a third part of the angels in heaven. Who would want to deceive the whole world into falling? Generation after generation after generation after generation. Who? And the New Testament, John the Revelator, had a revelation given to him by our Savior that said that Satan knew he had but a short time was going to deceive the whole world, all except the elect. Be of the elect. Study to show thyself approved. And remember, I say this here few there be that find the way.